You are now watching Showbiz Nap, your daily showbiz update. ABS-CBN mag-aantay pa ng matagal para ang kanilang kaso ng franchise sa Congress ay mapag-usapan. Ito nga ang inilinaw ni House Speaker Lord Alan Velasco. Ito ay nakastate na ang fate nga daw ng ABS-CBN franchise ay mapapag-usapan na sa 19th Congress or sa susunod na kongreso. Ito ay sa 2022 kung sakasakali man matatagalan pa rin dahil marami pang proseso. Narito naman ang naging article dito ng Lions Heart TV. The 8th Congress will have a new session coming on July 26 and some are asking if there will be a chance that they may discuss once again to bring back ABS-CBN. As the 22 election approaches, it is also wondered if Velasco would change his mind and we discuss the network's fate since the media company has a great reach and influence in the country. Velasco said, I believe sa next Congress na po talaga matatalaka yan at CNN Philippines, the source in tape interview on Thursday. Velasco said that the 18th Congress already decided on the issue and will prioritize many key measures of the present administration in the next session to fulfill the campaign promise of President Duterte. In a statement, Velasco said he wanted to see the passage of Bayanihan 3 as well as other economic bills before President Duterte's terms ends. On top of this priority legislation, we would like to see the passage of Bayanihan 3 as well as other economic bills, economics bills geared toward rebuilding the Philippine economic or economy shattered by the devastating impact of the global pandemic and rebuilding the lives of many every Filipino disrupted by the health, health crisis. Ang pagsasaad pa ni Velasco. ABS-CBN signed off on May 2025 or May 5, 2020. Ito'y matapos sila na makareceive ng cease and desist order from the National Telecommunications Commissions. If failed to get back on air after the House Committee on the Legislative Franchise denied its bid for a fresh 25-year license to operate because of its violation such as the citizenship of ABS-CBN Corporation Chairman Eugenio Lopez III, tax evasion, issuance of PDRs to foreign nationals, and violating provisions of their franchise. Yan nga ang mga kinakaharap na kaso ng ABS-CBN na dapat pag-usapan sa susunod na Congress. Well, mukhang mahaba-haba pa nga ang aantayin ng nasabing network para sa kanilang prangkisa. Yan ang ating showbiz na update. Ano ang masasabi nyo dito? Ilagay ang inyong opinion. Images are all credit to the rightful owners. Thank you for watching Showbiz Now.